this is my bad bank portfolio project application this is the home page where it just welcomes the customer uh, tells them about some upcoming events um, we can create an account now and the button stays disabled until I and even if I wanted to create an account I still need to add the email address Still, I need to have a password that's more than eight characters in length. And now I've created my account. This error message that pops up, this must be a valid email. This is due to um, the fact that I put the validation for email regex and it checks if it's a, an actual email address. So that's why that error comes up. So now I've created the account. Here we are inside the customer data here. It showcases our, you know, our information here. Ash the dog is already a customer here. And I just logged in here. Am I logged in? Deposit money shows my account balance. The button is disabled. Can't apply any letters except for error, but I can't apply any letters or any other keys. I'm going to deposit. So if I try to click the deposit button with no money in there, it doesn't allow me to. I must enter an amount first. So now I'm going to withdraw some money. I try to take out more than my account balance so it doesn't allow me to. And you must enter an amount before you can click the withdraw button. So there you have it. Um, some of the challenges I <clears throat> challenges I encountered with this project was uh, building the form that connected all of the um, links together. Bring it up here. Um, my design, I decided decided to um, I put the tags over the tooltips over each link, and I decided to add more, a card each page just to inform the customer of what's going on here also for future uh, features I'm going to put a financial market report feed through an API on the, the page also there'll be a user history database and a personal loan advisor provided through a chat bot 3000 and try to incorporate a chat uh, GBT into the app so that's my project and had a lot of fun doing it, learned a lot. Bootstrap was a challenge to learn um, this grid system, but overall it was a very learning process and I enjoyed it. So thank you very much for watching.